Xaniacs. I'm Lainey. I'm Marshall. Today we're going to talk about The Guest by Katherine Grant. I read a Katherine Grant book a couple months ago called The Good Mother, I think it was called. Uh, it is a thriller book and I liked it a lot so I decided I wanted to request this book for review as well. Uh, and the basic premise is that at the beginning of the book you see a girl get attacked you get it mostly from her point of view, you know, something attacks her, she can't breathe, etc. Then when the book finally starts, that was like in the prologue, and the book follows the story of a family who, uh, whose son is accused of murdering the girl. But he doesn't really, I mean he knows her, but he doesn't know her that well because he had been bullied by this girl and her circle of friends he was a suspect so the mother is just she's, she's trying to protect him she's trying to protect him at the same time um a man comes to live with the family who is like the friend of their cousin that she does she's not really familiar with this guy but uh you know he needs to be uh employed and he needs a place to live so he's gonna live in their guest room for a while and uh the other thing about her is that she is a, uh, she has a lot of money. She, I think she owns an art gallery okay. and she's very successful at it. Her husband is not as successful at his job and I don't remember what he does, uh, but he travels quite a bit. So uh, there, there's a certain point where she starts to suspect that her husband might be cheating on her. Um, so she's trying to follow the clues for that as well as protecting her son from this murder and then she starts to suspect that maybe the guest has something to do with the murder and she's not really sure if, she, if he is or not. And with all of that together, uh, it pulls a really interesting storyline. Like it's, it's it, it pretty much I was like, whoa, 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 whoa. I mean, is there yeah. is there any particular reason she begins to suspect the guest for the murder, or uh, is it just like a hmm, this guy just randomly showed up? I think he might have something to do with it. There are reasons, okay. yes. I just can't get into them because okay. some of them might give it away and some of them might not. I will tell you though that the name of the book, the guest, I was like, you're not going to be like as brazen to come out and be like, it's the guest, like. It's like having a book called The Butler. <laughs> you know? Like, I, I, I don't know. So um, I'm not going to tell you if it, it really is that crazy or not, but... Um, okay. Yeah. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I mean, there's a lot of questions that I could have, but most of them are just like actual plot points, and you'd have to read the book I, to yeah, find it out. Yeah, you'd read the book to find that yeah, one out. Uh, it's, yeah. There are some things where I'm like, ooh, yeah. Because otherwise it seems like it's a pretty straightforward plot. You have two very different investigations going on. So. Yes, it is. It is. Um, I ended up giving it four stars just because there were a lot of points where I was like caught off guard. Like, oh, really? That just happened? Really? So I, I think that if you like thrillers, you'll probably like this because there's a lot that I did not expect. And for me, that's unusual. Um, there were some plot points that I felt like could be flushed out a little bit more, but it was mostly like, it was mostly there, mm. mostly there. Yes. So thank you so much for watching. I'll put all the information down below for you if you want to check out this book as well. And until next time, stay zany. Bye-bye.